and you learned everything you know about TV and film from watching the blog, I assume. Absolutely. You taught me everything I know. Everything he knows. <laughs> Hey guys, thanks for tuning in. I'm Tyler Mount, and you're tuned in to the Tyler Mount Vlog. Y'all, can you feel the love tonight? Because I certainly can, because my boo, and star of The Lion King, Rocky, and A Bronx Tale, the one, the only, Bradley Gibson is coming to sit on the couch and have fun with me today. We're gonna cuddle, we're gonna giggle, we're gonna have a good time. Come back in a second to see what's happening. Wow! <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, it is the <laughs> Bradley Gibson. Hi. Welcome to the Tyler Mount Vlog. Happy to be. I'm so excited you're here. Broadway is coming back, mm -hmm. and so is the vlog, honey. So we have a lot to gossip about, right? We're coming off a year and a half break, right? Tell me what you've done in the last, I don't know, 15 months. Um, I got married. <gasps> Do dish. I got married in Las Vegas, I eloped. Wait, really? Yeah. Were you planning on doing that? Oh, no, no, no. We had a great wedding planned in New Orleans, but. So you're a newlywed? Yep. Okay, how are we liking it? Love it, we got a dog. Oh, oh tell us about the dog. Cash, Cash is Clay. Shih Tzu Poodle, oh. Sheep Poo. Oh, are they the best? Though? Yeah, they're so smart. Perfect little size, very smart. Wiggle, wiggle, wiggle. Mm. So what was it like playing Simba? Was it as magical as you would think like a Disney magical experience would be? It was magical, it was stressful. Mm. The Simba track is quite fantastic because yeah. you don't do anything until 30, 30 seconds, seconds left of Act 1. Yeah, I think the show is great for all the principals because we all kind of like die trade. or trade. Yeah. We trade off, right? But when we get on stage, it's... Go, 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 go. Have you ever done a show obliteratedly hungover? Yes. Is it fun? It's hell. Oh, in the quarantine, I did get to see you because you released your new badass music video. Yeah. So talk to me about the music video and what was your inspiration behind the single? The song, Fool, I wrote it a long time ago yeah. when I got my heart stomped on. So I had been recording the song along with tons of other music. I then, was in a really awful state because George Floyd was murdered. Mm -hmm. And we were really coming to terms with our issues with the race in America. Gotcha. And I wanted to put out some art. The video was an example of the beauty of black people, mm -hmm. the beauty of black men. We don't have to fit into any kind of box, right? Sure. And that we are, we are, period. Mm -hmm. I think that's absolutely beautiful. And all too often, and when people ask, I think we as creatives, whether you're an actor, director, writer, or blogger, right? We oftentimes wait for someone to give us permission to create, as opposed to saying, no, 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 I'm gonna create and then burning hell to the call. Free. If you want to check out the music video, check it out on YouTube now Watch. and available where all music is streamed. Mm -hmm. So as you know, on the blog, we always play a game. Today is no exception. You look kind of terrified. I'm a little scared. You're gonna be great at this because today we are playing none other than the best friend challenge. Oh. It's like the newlywed game, but it's about you and I because we know each other super, super well, and so we're gonna kill it. Everything about you right now. Are you ready to play? Yes, do it. Come back in a second for a fun game with Bradley Gibson. <laughs> Woo! Okay, are you ready? I'm ready. No Let's pressure, go. it's just you, me, and four of my closest family members watching this. Okay. What is my biggest fear? Your biggest fear is snakes. No, uh, I don't like snakes, but my biggest fear is seeing a production of Wicked and Elf of Enough Lying. That's anxiety, man. Could you imagine? If I could have dinner with any celebrity, who would it be? Oh, let me tell you. I would say that you would love to do dinner with Lady Gaga, but that's not my answer. I'm gonna say Oprah Winfrey, let me tell you why it's Oprah. Okay. Because you would invite me because my answer is Oprah. Look, Oprah, I'm down for. Okay, of course She's you are. on my list. Yeah. Tina Turner. I want to sit down with Tina Turner and talk to her and say, Oh my. How did you do it? I'm, I'm going to have a dinner party and invite you. Yes. The two of us, Oprah, Michelle, Tina Turner, and Beyonce. And Brock can come too. Brock can come too. He can cook. D for D the dishes or something. Dessert. Okay, what is my perfect date? You would have cocktails at <laughs> Glass House. Oh, we love a Glass House you cocktail. Would have Dinner at uh at Glass House maybe Glass House. You would actually just go to, to Glass the bar, House to a table. And what show am I saying? I'm gonna see Wicked. Ah! <laughs> you heard it here first. If you're looking to court me, take me to Glass House Tavern than Wicked. What's my dream role? Oh my gosh! You know what? Your dream role is one that hasn't been created yet. You want to originate a role, an original role that is beautiful. It is poignant. It speaks to your character and it speaks to the greater conversation we're having as a nation. Why? Because you were talented and you deserve the spotlight and the Tony Award. Wow, you hit it right on the head. Woo, Bradley! 
I am sweating. It's okay. But you, I know it's okay. This is my show. But what I will say is I feel like your best friend now. We are best friends. Can we get matching face tattoos? Absolutely. You have fun on the show? The best time. Thank you for coming. I appreciate it. Absolutely. If you liked what you saw, and God knows you did, share this with a friend, but most importantly, what Bradley? Subscribe. Right on down here. And if you want more Bradley, because I don't know who wouldn't, you can follow him on Instagram at Brad Gibson 13. And be sure you're following my Broadway journey all year long on Instagram, Facebook, Twitter, and TikTok at Tyler G. Mouth. Until next time, I'm Tyler. I'm Bradley. Reminding you to give love. Wow.